important thing about it. I think it has brought a sense of even though we're a small place, we still have access to a beautiful facility like this. So a sense of uh, not superiority, but not feeling inferior to big cities or bigger locations that might have places like this. So a sense of, hey, even though we're a small place, we still deserve this. I helped with, besides Jerry Zielinski and his wife Sharon, and Mr. Rue, Dan, and Glenn Kinder, we moved all of this stuff up in here and set it all up. And people who come in here from the community or from other places that are visiting the community can't believe what kind of facility we have here. So it's, it's an incredible place. I also really like the drama room. It's really like warm too. And I like the school and like it's really beautiful. Yeah, it's yes. big and windowy and like I like it way better than I like the like district uh, school board meetings here. We've had professional development days here, which there'll be another one this week. It's been used for a wedding, that space. It's also been used for a memorial service. So what, what I like about it is it's so multi-purpose. We're actually seeing way more of the community coming in than we used to. During the day, evenings, weekends, whatever. It's really getting used. It's really, really... I think it's brought uh, good energy. I think it's brought good vibe. I think it's brought a sense of, of, um, a sense of place because now people have a place that they can go to and like to be at. It's a place where my children grew up in and went to school at. So it, it's, it means quite a bit to me. It's deep in the fabric of who I am in terms of why, why I like what it's done for myself and my family. Lots of people have come together to not only build the school but also to build community rooms. There's a family place that was not, we didn't have a, an early childhood center before so that's a new piece that's we're really looking forward to seeing that, the effects of that on young children and uh, giving parents and, and uh, small, small kids a place to come for many different uh, programming pieces as well as community rooms that Behind me here are three community rooms and a fitness center as well that uh, the community fundraised for. And if you if you pan over there, there's a playground that the community just got together this weekend to build and it was all fundraised through parents too. Uh, now is a time of lots of great conversations of change for rural education, especially in secondary education. And this school to me just gives us a possibility to create something new and something that's really based on environmental sustainability, as well as just giving us a fresh perspective on, on uh, what we can do and also also just the confidence to think that if we can put the school together as a community and all the pieces to it we can also achieve lots of other great things in education too. I like coming up in the morning it's pretty nice to be able to come here in the morning and love where you walk into to go to work so I think this morning I came and it was it just had been raining overnight and the smell of the of the great place we live, clean air, and just walking up to the school. It's a new beautiful building and it's a great community place. Lots of different community groups come and interact here, like fiddling and art groups and yoga and the gym and just lots of people come and hang out here. Well, it's a really great place to work because it's so bright and beautiful and I get to look out and see this beautiful view every time I sit down and do work. And I think it is great for students too because they can see, wow, I live in this beautiful spot and I have a beautiful school to go to and it gives them some pride as well. Uh, architecturally wise, they're windows probably because <laughs> there's so many beautiful windows. My favorite part of the school is the courtyard. So I can sit outside amongst the rocks and the water. It's a beautiful school. I think it's a much healthier village. It took away my... Um, regular walk with my dogs because I used to walk through the forest here all the time. But uh, for me personally, the fitness center has been a real The best thing that it's brought to the community is um, the fact that it's a community school. So it's a central location that kind of brings community members together. And um, it's, it's kind of a, yeah, I, I think that that piece is the most important piece that it's brought the community um, together where um, there's more involvement by more members of the community. Things like growth and change and development, new opportunities. I think it's helped really bring kind of a community center space again because so many activities go on within the school uh, building and a lot of the community members really pitched in, for example, to build this childcare space and to build another community space within the school. So I think it really helped unite the community even before the new school was manifested. 
It's the community. It means to me that a space where community can come together, for example, um, you know, there's been funerals held here, which before was just unheard of, and people are seeing the new school as a space where they can come together. Well, it's impacted very positively. Um, people are very proud of the new school. Um, they love to go there for meetings and to play and participate in the community. I think it gives us a lot more community pride, although we've always been uh, proud of ourselves. People are more active, they're using the fitness place, they're really excited to have the family place and have a, a daycare and a, a preschool space. Um, I think it just generated excitement. We've always uh, been, been proud of who we are and where we are and the sense of community that exists here has just given us part of a committee that fought for over 10 years to have a school here. And then um, I was one of the fundraisers for the community portions of the school. So um, I think to be recognized in this way is huge for us. You know, the, the province recognized that we needed the school and then not just building a great school, but they built a school that met the lead gold environmental standard. So they've just validated us. We knew that we were important and valuable and they've just made us feel even more so. And it's an attraction to bring people to our community as well, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah.